What's up guys, this is Karan here back with another video. Welcome back to Tech Karan YouTube channel. MIUI Mix 12.1 by MMX Team. Weekly update is available for a lot of devices including Redmi Note 8. Redmi Note 8 got 20.6.17 beta version but other devices got 20.6.18. So in this video I have installed this beta version on my Xiaomi Redmi Note 8 and I'm gonna make a review on MIUI Mix Room which you should install on any of your Xiaomi compatible device. Which are the things you get in MIUI Mix, why it is one of the best ever room based on MIUI 12. Make sure to watch this video till the end. Let's get started right now. Okay, so we are here at the home screen. Like other MIUI 12 based rooms, you also get the default theme like this. The wallpaper is same, the icons are same, everything is just same here including the control center which has all the important features dark mode, battery saver, floating window, screen recorder, hotspot etc. Every main feature is available almost every main feature which means no extra features but no feature is missing too. Swiping the swiping right you have the option to enable the google this feed or if you want to use app word you can choose the app word option available too but swiping up you will see the global search option which is kind of um, a negative thing because you cannot disable this i'm using from some time and i didn't got any solution of disabling it no options to configure to disable this global search option from the home screen which is kind of boring for me because i want to disable these things and if the option is not available especially while using this option if you want to choose abdrar option might be might you can disable that option from settings talking about other things weather gallery me video music everything is just same no extra things available here talking about the theme store here we have the chinese theme store as expected and if you want to install any theme which is not compatible that will show you the warning but the theme if it is compatible it will not show you the warning here as you can see this theme isn't fully compatible with this version of MIUI yet so you can try out to compatible if you can try out to download this theme or you can skip this theme like i do or you can also export sorry import the third party themes from your sd card if you have an mtz file so let me just show you that importing does not have any issues so just click on the import option select the theme file mtz file wait for the time wait for it to finish and here it is the theme is imported you can apply this theme directly without having any issues so that's another cool thing a positive thing and in fonts you have a lot of extra options you can add any fonts you can download any fonts you can apply any fonts and this is one of the best thing about me at 12 you don't need any reboot after applying fonts Security tab have all the same features, cleaner, security scan, you get the battery option, you get the manage app and block list option. And talking about the game turbo, that's a bug if you have noticed, game turbo is not launching. I am using this on my Redmi Note 8 which means in Redmi Note 8 you cannot use game turbo. Um, talking about the other devices, I am not sure about that. All the things are everything is just same but talking about the game turbo, I am not sure about that. that all devices have this bug or only redmi note 8 i have tried to launch from everywhere tried to launch from settings also but game turbo is not opening at all so this is kind of a game turbo is missing move on to some other things let me just show you in google play store one more thing talking about the device is certified or not when you go to settings and here you have the option of device is not certified that's a very very big disadvantage for some guys for me it's not but for some guys it's a disadvantage that device is not certified it should be certified and talking about the magic manager i'm using magic latest 20.4 so talking about the safety net status let me just show you cts is false but basic integrity is true you need both true to properly run some banking apps which means you might probably get an error by using banking apps so which means you cannot use those banking apps but you can survive without banking apps also there are some other methods to use banking apps if you want to but it all depends upon preferences 
moving on to some other things we're gonna share now we're gonna open up settings where you get all the same things sim card and mobile networks lock screen display and display you have the anti flicker mode which is quite interesting dc dimming prevents extensive flickering and reduces eye strain in low light conditions that's a quite impressive feature in miui mix and this is one of the biggest change in if you talk about some other rooms based on miui 12 control center and notification shade you have all the same features use new control center and switch control center side and all other things are same you have the option to customize a battery indicator you also get the option of hide notch if you have a notch enabled device like me moving on to some other things everything is the same sound and vibration notification and home screen as i already told you there is no option of disabling the swipe up global search option i have tried and tried to find out but i didn't got any option available here home screen option available classic and with app drawer whichever you choose you can choose that one but i don't want to choose app drawer right now and as you can see we have the option to choose the app word and google discover i have already chosen the google discover that's perfectly fine and working and um, you already know about that password security you also get all the same features password fingerprint and face unlock and here in additional settings you get the same features of full screen display and developer options etc screen time the latest screen time from miui 12 and in special features i have tried to launch the game turbo from here too which is not working at all but talking about other things we have the video toolbox that's perfectly fine we have the floating window that was also perfectly fine too second space miui lab and light mode everything is just fine great and no issues in using so all these things i have already shown you no extra things are here but this is quite stable talking about the recent animation that is just great the multitasking is great too the app opening and app closing is great too this is one of the best thing in performance that's why i just like this room so i recommend you to choose this room on your device also because you will feel pretty satisfied after using this build Talking about the Ultra CVM, if you don't know what is Ultra CVM, actually this is kind of Gcam 7.4 which has some extra features. Let me just show you, go to settings and here you have some advanced features, Ultra CVM settings, mode configuration where you can, where you can mode a lot of things if you have knowledge what you are doing. If you want full review on Ultra CVM, the link for this is in the description, go and check it out and you will check out how ultra cvm works and everything in this video so this was all from today's video i hope you like it don't forget to like share and subscribe goodbye have a nice day